Hey everyone, and welcome to The Long Dark. Um, it is a new game that is currently in early access, and it's a survival game. And we're not going to waste any time, we're just going to go ahead and get on in this. We're going to go with the capable survivor. And we'll just call this story one. Hope everyone's having themselves a good weekend. And there's no music in this because I have turned it off just to avoid any potential copyright issues but anyway so <clears throat> yeah like I said the long dark is a survival game and as soon as it will let me skip I will and there we go That looks painful. Astrid! Twelve hours earlier. The Joker. The Joker. Seems about right. <sighs> Feels like another record cold snap on the way. I'd better get a fire going before the pipes freeze up again. We'll take those. Great Bear Island. Dad used to fly there all the time. He said it used to be beautiful. Not much reason to go there these days, since the quakes and all. We don't care about that. Poster, we'll look at that later. Potentially. I guess we'll try building a fire.
Turned out pretty well. If I say so myself. Explore the hangar. Well, here we are, old girl. Your best flights may be behind you, but you're still beautiful to me. And anyways, you're all I've got. I'd sure love to give you one last great adventure. Something's humming. I don't remember needing my parka this early in the season. It seems to get colder every year. Okay. Can't go outside. <sighs> Cheap electric crap. Never works when you need it. Getting pretty late in the day. Guess I could take a nap. You're tired. Take a nap. Don't tell me what to do. You ain't my mama. Jackrabbit remote transport. Zero flights a day to the mainland communities and, well, anywhere really. Those were better days. else that we can see? Nope. So I guess we'll go ahead and take a nap, like it said. Who could that be? Jackrabbit remote transport, Mackenzie speaking. I told her not to come up. I told her you couldn't fly in this weather. For once, will you not be so damn Whoa, well, well, slow down, Maureen. What are you talking about? She just showed up. Said you'd see her. Said you'd fly her north. I know you need the money. The weather service it's okay, Maureen. I've got it from here. Uh. uh. Hello, Will. What are you doing here? It's been a while, I know. Yeah. Years. I haven't heard from you since... I know. I know. And I wouldn't be here if it weren't important. Well... What brings you... I mean... Are you sick? <laughs> no. No, not me. But I need to get to someone who is. Right. So you're still a doctor? Yes, I'm still a doctor. I thought that after... <laughs> Why are you here? I need your help. There's an isolated community in the northern part of Great Bear. Someone there is very sick. Great Bear? There's nothing there anymore. Not since... I know. But I have to get there. Still trying to save the world, huh? Somebody has to. What's that supposed to mean? Mackenzie... Uh, Will... I didn't come here to fight about the past. I need a pilot to take me somewhere remote. Someone who won't ask too many questions. Someone I can trust. Wait, questions? Astrid, are you in trouble? Are you gonna help me, or not? What's in the case? See, there's that thing about no questions, remember? What's in the case, Astrid? No questions. Sorry, but if you're gonna ask me for help, I need to know Look, why. The weather out there is bad. Bad. When I mean, it's getting worse. You walk in here after years. I could have been dead. You could have been. And then you show up and you want me to just risk my life flying into the middle of the great northern nowhere to deliver you and some mystery metal case to some remote wilderness outpost. All because you walked in here and asked me to? 
Yes. Astrid, you can't bring him back. This isn't about that. I know how hard it's been. No. You don't know, Mackenzie. You don't know anything. You don't think I feel it too? Are you gonna take me or not? The longer I wait, the worse it'll get. Damn it. Look, I don't have time for this. Wait. The worse what will get? Why do I have a feeling you're not talking about the weather? Because I'm not. Do, do, do. Throw your bags in the plane. I'll get started on pre-flight. Better buckle up tight, because it's going to be a rough ride. Alrighty. Let's see. Two people plus enough fuel to get us out to Great Bear and back leaves. Hmm. Almost no capacity for cargo. If we're too heavy, we'll burn through our fuel before we get there. I'll have to be careful about what else I take with me. Got emergency food, first aid kit, or a distress pistol kit. Astrid's traveling pretty light. The mysterious case. Astrid mm. definitely doesn't want to talk about what's so inside. So what do we take? Which means Food? First aid? he's probably not supposed to have or it. Or the distress pistol. Based off of what we saw at the very start, thinking I'm going to need the first aid After kit. After the doctor, so we're covered there. But probably best to have some extra meds just in case. I don't think it's going to let me take more than that. Yeah, Just no, to that's, that's all it's, that's all it's gonna go. let us take. Alright, so we grab our parka. This is Captain Idaho speaking. It's a balmy negative 5,000 degrees. Buckle up for turbulence. We're in what? Your ring. Our ring. Oh. Yeah. I mean, uh, I just forgot to take it off. I wear mine too. Why? Memories, I guess. I thought you wanted to forget. Not all of it. Look. I, I should have looked for you. It's okay. I've kept busy. I've moved on. You sure? Because this all seems pretty familiar. You still working with that researcher, doctor? What's his name? No. No, I'm not working at the center anymore. Well, then where? I'm working on my own. Freelance, you could say. Freelance doctor? That sounds legit. I don't question your life choices, Mackenzie. Plenty of things you could be doing besides hanging out in your dad's old plane and drinking in the daytime. Hey, we had a lot of good times in this plane. And it's under control. I know, okay? I'm not here to fight, really. I think about them all the time, you know? I know you do. But I did. The choice I made. I did it for us. But you don't have to. Let's just not... No. It's important that you hear this. There's things I need to Mackenzie, say. Mackenzie, not now. There's... Just let me tell you. Will, shut up for a second. Something's wrong. That is not good. What's going on? 
Power's gone. The whole electrical system looks fried. Shit! What's happening? No power means we're going down. Hold tight. Going down! Will? Well, that just happened. And we're back to this. Astrid. Astrid. Must have gone right through the windshield. Trees broke my fall. Mostly. Oh, mostly. Spend <laughs> time on that. We need. Gotta stop that blood loss. loss. Yes, please. Uh, we'll take the cloth. Damn. I need to find some place to... Need some first aid. Um, can we get out of this weather? Yeah. Um, oh wait, here's a here's a cake. Wait a second, I had more cloth than that.
this is the problem that I seem to have every single time. Oh, wait. Place. Too close to another object. Place. There we go. Start fire. We figured it out. Hallelujah. I can't tell you how many times Come I have on. tried to do this. I don't feel so good. Nope, not that one. Uh, let's drink that. I don't feel so good. Did we survive? We Astrid did. hasn't come looking for me. We survived. Which means she can't come looking for me. Because she's hurt. Or worse. I'd better get back up to the crash site. Let's take this stuff. Just because I feel like we're going to need it. Try to find that box empty. That's a crate. So, how do we get up there? Not that way. Firewoods. I could probably friend. climb that. You probably could climb that, but let's explore first. Feet. Can we start a fire? I could eat anything. Surrounded by snow, and nothing to drink. We're gonna die. <sighs> I can't find anything to drink. I think I'm gonna make it. Finally made it. 
Have we? the plane not sure which of us looks worse poor girl this isn't how things were supposed to end I've been looking for you Astrid's back come on be some food be some yeah there we go there we go there we go Whatever's in this case, Astrid was ready to die for it. I hope she hasn't already died for it. Okay, let's, uh, actions. Really, we can't put any of this stuff on. Damn, I'm freezing. like sandpaper. I don't know if I was supposed to take that, but I did. Now. Damn it. food. And where are we supposed to go? That's where we came from. I'm too tired to think straight. Definitely passed through here, and in a hurry. I want to make a fire. How did I make a fire before? <sighs> I 
Well, I don't know. I, I can't remember. I hit I hit something specific on my button. But I don't know what it was. Now I can't grab it. This seems like a dumb idea. <laughs> I'd eat anything right about now. Dude, you suck. Ooh, a campfire. Someone's been here recently. Could it have been Astrid? Start fire. Come on. Okay. Fire's life out here. Take it. Take it. Now then, um... Let's get some water. Recycled can. Let's see if there's any food. No, 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 no. Keep going. Really? Come on. See if we can find some more firewood. Ah, damn Ouch! It. Birds. Uh oh. Ah, We're about to die. That hurts so much. We're about to die. <sighs> the pain. Oh, come on. Oh. 
Oh, come on. This is one thing I hate about this game. In the numerous times that I have tried playing it. When you're about to die, this happens. I'm not even controlling it right now. Other than to look around. I can't move. I'm pushing I've up. I've never felt so cold in my life. Quit moving away from the fire, you dummy. Alright, I'm just gonna let him die. And then the next time that we play, we're taking the food instead of the first aid. There we go. So yeah, that's going to do it for this. I thought I'd just give you guys a little snippet of this. Um, like I said, I'm going to restart, and next time I'm taking the food instead of the first aid. And uh, yeah, but... If you like this, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe. And also, I um, I have started streaming over on Twitch. Uh, don't really have a schedule in place of far, as far as when I stream, um, but I have started streaming over there. But yeah, so um, I guess I will talk to you guys next time.